Know the limits of YouTube tags so you can get more views by using them correctly in your videos. You cannot have a tag with only one character. That's not allowed. That's a limit. You have to have at least two. A space in one of your tags counts as three characters in the 500 limit. So try to minimize spaces. I will go over all the limits in this video about YouTube tags in 2021. First, where do you go to put tags? Open up YouTube Studio, go to your any of your videos, scroll down to see more, click it, it's hidden under the see more. And here are all your tags. Now you notice this video, I'm only using 389. Bad boy, George. I should be using as, as close to 500 as possible. So I can just go type more tags or I can go to our tag optimizer, which I'll show you how to use to get you in this case to 497 out of 500 uh, characters allowed. But first, where do these tags appear? When you watch your video on YouTube and you open up the HTML source, you'll see this meta name equals keywords. These are all your tags, guys. Search engines look at this and rank your video based in part by the tags you've written here. So you want to put as many relevant keyword rich tags into your videos so that this gets picked up by search engines and gets you more views. So let me go over the tag optimizer because this will save you time instead of you just typing tags manually into each of your videos. If you place the video ID, which is the video I showed you, this dark deity is number three top selling Steam game right now, and it really was. Click that I to see the video in case you're interested to see it. So I put in the video ID or a link to the video, and then it shows me my current tags, as well as new tags that the system suggests for you. This is, what, this is where, where it saves you time. And you can also put in custom tags where you type the tags that you uh, want to add yourself. When I'm done, I see I'm using now as many as I can, 497, and I simply click copy here. Then I go back to my video, delete the current tags, and paste. Boom. Look, 497 out of 500 is now in use. Perfect. Then I click save, and you'll notice one of the new ones, Strategy RPG. If I go back to the uh, video. It doesn't appear here. These are my old tags. Now I'm going to refresh, reload Thanks the video. And now look, strategy RPG is in the keywords meta in the source of the HTML of this page, which search engines index. So it will help me get more views. Now when people search for strategy RPG or SRPG, which is also in the list of tags, and that's what you should do in your videos, Freedom Family, Freedom Family, to help you grow. What is the spirit of freedom? We all help each other grow together as a family. And I continue making videos like this to help you grow. So tell me down there in the comments below what you like, what you don't like, and help each other. Give each other tips and advice. Share your best practices to follow the spirit of freedom. Now you might be wondering, where do I go? to get this cool tag optimizer. I haven't, we haven't launched it yet, but I'll show you from the very beginning of how this works. If I take this Dark Deity video, copy the link and paste it here, it will automatically generate the tags for me. And I'm going to move myself out of the way here. So you can see that these are the current tags. This is what it's suggesting. I can add more tags like, uh, what is Steam, how Steam works, what does Valve do, if I thought that was important. Then I can select all of my tags. Oh, but I'm already over the 500 limit, so I have to remove it because I've already optimized my tags, so I have no more spare room. But if I remove some of these tags, remove, 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 then I have some more space, 406, so I can choose some of these. And you can see it color codes the tags, so I know which ones are new. And if I want to add some custom tags like SRPG or strategic role playing game and I select one of these, then I can then it'll add it in another color so I can see exactly which tags are coming from which box. Pretty cool, huh? 
And then I click copy and paste and I have my new optimized tags. In the future, we will add a view analytics, which will show you how many views your videos got before optimizing your tags and how many views they got after. So you can quickly see if the tags are helping or hurting or doing nothing for your growth of your channel and your videos. That's coming soon. And we're also gonna be building a community feature where you'll be able to ask your audience to suggest tags for you so your fans can help optimize your videos to help you get more views. These are all things we wanna build into our YouTube Tags Optimizer, but as I said, I don't have a link to share right now. I will as soon as I do in a future video. And what do you think about this tool? Tell me down there in the comments below. One other cool thing you can do is before you've even uploaded a video, you can just type in a title like my dark deity uh, gameplay review. And this is my gameplay review. I'll just keep it really short. And then I can click get my tags. So the tag optimizer, just from a title and description, will give you suggested tags. And I can select all of these and boom, I have now all my tags if I want to use them for my new video that I haven't even uploaded yet. So it's really cool that you can save time by giving you all of these combinations. And these are quite relevant. Dark Deity Switch, Dark Deity Mac, Dark Deity Free Download. Actually, this one isn't relevant because it's not a free download. So you have to you know, read them and make sure they're, uh, they're all correct. Uh, and then when you're done, uh, just click copy and then put them into your YouTube tags to save you time and get more views. All right, Freedom Family, I hope this helps you understand tags better in 2021. And if YouTube makes changes in 2022, I will make another video updating you. But in the meantime, click that I, whoops, yes, over there. <laughs> that uh, will show you the playlist of all the episodes of The George Show in case you missed any to help you grow. And uh, speaking of Dark Deity, if you go to the Steam page, you'll notice something really cool. It has an 86 Metacritic score. This is a huge achievement. Only a few games ever cross 80 as a Metacritic score. If I click this link, it'll show you that this is it. These are all the games that have over 80 Metacritic score and we're number 10 in the world of all games ever. It's incredible. What is Metacritic? Metacritic takes respected game reviews. These are sites that they've uh, whitelisted so you don't just get this from any game review site who review your game and uh, give you a score and then it averages them all uh, to give you the 86. We had one that pulled us down from Screen Rant. Urgh, screen Rant, what's, what's wrong with our game guy? Actually, 70 is still a really good score, relatively speaking. But anyway, check it out. Links are down there in the description below. And I hope you enjoy Dark Deity. Get it on Steam, it's out now. We launched it on E3 during the E3 live stream. And uh, yeah, I hope you enjoy the game. If you have gotten it and you've played it, tell me down there in the comments below what you think of it. All right, Freedom Family, who am I? I'm gonna go full screen. Boom. Who am I? I'm the guy that doesn't know how to play a guitar. That's a guitar behind me. And I will learn how to play it or my daughters will teach me or I'll have them perform for you. So I am George. I am the CEO and founder of Freedom for Freedom and the Freedom Family, where we all help each other grow together as a family. Shout outs to Freedom Games, shout outs to Freedom Music, shout outs to MGN.GG, which is our uh, game article site where we review games. And I am, of course, hiding everything. Where we review games. <laughs> Let me move myself to the right. As well as give you first impressions and detailed game reviews, guides, of games like The Cycle, they're only in closed alpha, to Friday Night Funkin', where you can download all the mods, and everything in between. There's lots of great content here. I hope you enjoy what we're writing for you. That's not a lot, actually. We have a lot of Friday Night Funkin' lately. Ah, oh, here we go. Final Fantasy VII Remake DLC review. So you get the idea. Each article has some, has a nice detailed screenshots and text to give you a lot more information about what it is uh, you're reading. All right, Freedom Family, until the next episode, I am George, 
and you've been watching. Ooh, you dreaming about love. Yeah. Click that eye to partner with Freedom and join the Freedom family so we can all grow together. You get many perks like position music, you also get epidemic sound, a lot of other access to royalty free videos, sponsorships, and many things to help you grow. Just click the links down there in the description below to get involved in our community, our forums, our Discord chat servers, meet our graphics team, meet our community team, all of that on Discord and the forums. What are you waiting for? Get started. And we will grow together as a family because this is the Freedom Family. You are part of it, we are all part of it, and we're all growing together. To get more George, click that big F. That will subscribe you to Freedom Central, home of The George Show. And PewDiePie gave one of you, Freedom Family, a big shout out. Click that video to see the shout out and to see our new 3D sets for you. And click that video to see what YouTube recommends you watch next.